to Carthwaston. I probably pronounced it incorrectly. Who's having a fire here? Who is having a fire here? This close to a road park ranger shack does not agree with this. Well, we, we, we must protect our natural landscape. It's very important to do it near the road. If you do it in the woods, you're gonna set the woods on fire. Stay too close to the road though, and if you do it, you're supposed to stay off the trail, but not directly on the trail. This is directly on the trail in between the side of this regiment. If you don't set up the campfire next to the road, how can you invite strangers to sit down for a while at the campfire? And then murder them, criminal! Exactly. I see a person. I see a person. I'm pretty sure they're evil. What did they do? Evil things. <laughs> Let's go investigate what you just killed. Uh, he's got a compatriot that's shooting at us. An evil per- Oh, the chicken witnessed my crime. <laughs> oh, it was a Forsworn. Oh, we were told that Forsworn are bad. Forsworn are bad. Oh, uh, okay. I killed no remorse. Incidentally, I just want you to acknowledge that I am at a two for two. I hit a dude from long range in the head, and then I also hit that dude in the head as he was sprinting towards you. Yeah. yeah just, uh, just acknowledge that I'm two for two. Today and then, you are two for and two. And Inigo, I am a better archer than you. <clears throat> Welcome to the team, Inigo. Friendly fire is common. There you I are. I love the morning. So many possibilities everywhere I look. <laughs> With my good eye! The arrow is now a targeting system for him. <laughs> He, the, he points his head at something, and then the arrow tells him which which way to go. Ah, marvelous. You might want to stop that from bleeding. What is this, anyway? A building! Pavo's house. Was that Pavo? <laughs> Did I kill Pavo? Let's root through his things and find out. <laughs> nice. Ah, this is an empty house. No one is here. It might very well have been his house. Cheese! I'm going to steal his cabbage. Be sure to loot all of his aged bread and cheese. There's a specific thing that I'm looking for. I just gotta remember what you need to make it. Vegetable soup and vegetable stew. Yeah, apparently this stuff is broken. In the sense of... Uh, well, it restores one point of health per second for 720, and it restores one point of stamina per second for 720. So, it... so basically it just means that you get free power attack every second. Oh, basically you can do unlimited power attacks then, Pretty huh? much. Okay. So I need potato, cabbage, leek, tomato. So that's, the, that's really the only food that I should be keeping my eye out for. A pure diet of vegetable soup. You're going vegan! I'm just gonna call him Inigo. I, I'm sure that's not how you pronounce his name, but no matter what... Those are your swords? <laughs> Man, you guys deserve me to shoot you with an arrow. Like you're whacking us with a pine cone. Silly. Man, that... I do feel kind of bad for chicken, though. I you did... killed that chicken's master! Yeah, I do feel kind of bad about that. But not enough to rewind time. Onward we go! Nah. Hey, there are some folks up ahead. We should warn them about the forest sword on these roads. Hey! You got... Are you vigilant to Stendar? You got the robes for it. Never should have... Well, hold what, on! What are, we, what are we sprinting for? Oh my god! Oh, they already know about the forest sword, because they're in oh, combat ow, with them! Ow. And they slowed you with your ice cups! <laughs> Fight to wake you up in the morning, eh? Ow. Let me give you some room. So uh, Hello? Yeah. Oh, I, you keep you keep The Vigilance of Stendar will fight even in death! <laughs> Great. Alright, well apparently we're very deep in Forsworn territory now. So this road should take us to Karth Waston. We'll see if we can find the Sybil. Maybe they'll be civilized and tell us everything we want to know. Ugh. <laughs> Gotta be somewhere around here, right? Hey! This person looks reputable. You're not from here, and we don't need to be talking. It's a real sausage fest around here. You guys got any chicks? Damn it, man. Are you trying to taunt us? What are you talking about? Our daughter, Fiotra, was taken from here. The Forsworn descended, and they didn't touch anything else, just our little girl. Oh. Where did they take her? It was the Forsworn from Broken Tower. Never been much trouble before. What's it to you? Your daughter's the Sybil of Debella. She... Really? Yeah. Well, that's... I, I, I wouldn't have dreamed. Of course we need her in Markarth, then. I'll come with you. Well, no, I don't know, man. It's pretty dangerous out there. You should probably stay here. You are probably right. Just hurry, please. Who knows what those things are doing to her? 
if she gets captured by people and then she either has to watch her father die or she watches her father impale and then gut a man that that might give her a little bit of ptsd so we'll we'll hold off on that one don't want to traumatize her yeah sybil like the dalai lama of skyrim is that what that is I, it feels like it what's it's what it is I'm pretty sure that the thalmor said that reincarnation is illegal random passers-by <laughs> are these guys gonna get gutted as well probably just like everybody dies man if you want to be fatalistic about it there's the broken tower let's fix them or something lots of force I spotted the spotter Oh, for a second, I really thought that was a dummy. <laughs> just kind of stand there. Because they, they just stood there and took it. So I was <laughs> like, oh no, there's, there, it's a dummy. Nope, he's just stupid. Uh, guys, you might want to turn around. There's not there's not cool stuff happening here right now. Go, go, go the other way. Into the readout. I really doubt they'll survive. Start firing first. Ask what later. You know, Forsworn, if you want to convince people that you're the good guys, maybe don't leave a bunch of human body parts laying around. I'm, I'm just saying. They're not the only one who's doing that, though. Ow! Oh, 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 thank goodness you built up an immunity to traps over time. That would have been frustrating. Fudge! <laughs> Give me the I knew it. Knew what? <laughs> <laughs> See, she didn't have enough training. <laughs> I'm glad that I was standing where I was, cause holy crap. Oh, wait, 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 I have something for this, I have something for this. Aha, yes, lock it. Yeah, you're not the only one that can do magic stuff. <laughs> she's, she's doing a magic ward on you though. Uh, the other dangers this place has in store for us. Mm hmm, that worked well. Why put the spikes there? You're not trying to keep are you trying to keep someone from decorating the walls? Do you have problems with rogue interior decorators coming in here and being like, you know, a tapestry would really tie this room together? I, I wouldn't decorate my base with a bunch of spikes protruding outward. That's what I'm saying, man. Why the spike? Whatever. Okay, here we go. Is someone there? Hello? What That's you a wearing? trap right there. Don't step on that trap. Okay, I see this thing's head. All right. Inigo, I'm sorry. The sacrifice is not worth it. I got him, don't worry about it. Okay, and the trap is clear. He's a briar heart. He literally has a briar heart. Okay. I am not feeling at my best. It is a good thing I heal quickly. It's made out of fur and it's got like horns on it, but it's it's not one specific animal. I think it's made out of several animals. All right. Oh shit. The, they actually replaced his heart with plants. Wow, okay, that's a weird ritual. Commitment to the role, I guess. Child. Oh, you're younger than I thought you would be. Are you one of them? Please don't hurt me. I'm here to bring you to the temple in Markarth. Then it's true what they said. I'm touched by the gods. Show me on the doll where the gods touched you. I've heard stories about the wonders of the great temple in Markarth, but I never dreamed that I would even get to see it. I am honored to be called for this duty. Please lead on. Okay. So, Let's go. Yep. Also, uh, hang on. We gotta we gotta do some looting first. <laughs> yeah. Get it? Get it? That was it. Okay. A looting! Yeah. I do get it. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Sybil, let us show you what fast traveling looks like. Ever teleported before? It's fun. Would you like to? Before we bring you to the temple, let's let you have a chance to say goodbye to your father forever. He could go see her. I, <laughs> I found your daughter. Fiotra. Father. Fiotra, dear. Did they hurt you? Of course not. My spirit remains strong. Can't look her in the eye. Too ashamed. My little girl. Always strong. Do you know where you have to go? I'm to go to the temple in Markar. I, I know you're I'll have to leave you in Calm down a little bit. It's our honor to have you there. This man is going to take you to Markarth. Are you ready? Of course. All right, now we can go to Markarth. I'm going to be a silversmith one day, like my mother and father. I, nope, you're going to be, uh, well, actually, I have no idea if that's something that they can do in the Temple of Tabella, yes. so maybe you will be. 
They were kind of unclear about what they do there. They worship Debella. Pretty open and shut, I'd say. Now they won't kill me. Thank you for bringing the daughter here. We'll kill you now. Ah, oh, man. All right. Oh, hello, Passion Dancer Debella. Ugh. Which is her actual title. I looked it up. You know, I'm not allowed in here, but I'm allowed in here now. Hello. Speak. We brought you Sybil. Let the girl come with me and we can begin her preparation. I will send word to her family that she is in good hands. Okay. You've truly earned the blessing of Debella, child. Woo! Prostrate yourself before her altar, I'm, and sorry, she will what? bestow her gift. No, I had that checked last week. It's fine. What is the position in which we prostrate? Now, come with me, child. We'll prepare you for the goddess's presence. I, I guess that woman has control of that small girl now. Hopefully that's fine. Yeah, it's fine. The family's okay with it. They're okay with it. Maybe we should have asked the child what she wants? I, she sounded pretty stoked to, when I told her that we were going to bring her here. Fair enough. Guess we're done here. You're, you're drinking the dirty water? Mm, Debella Priestess bath water. <laughs> well, we have done a good thing today, I think. I think so. Let's go kill some more forest work. Oh, also, I want to sell some crap. I'm carrying a lot of random junk that I need to get rid of, and then I want to go talk to that guy. Oh, okay. Did you hear all that noise outside? It's just the market rabble. We should get back to work. It definitely wasn't a woman almost getting stabbed You to death. there. If you're here to trade, step up to the counter. Yeah, I guess up to trade. You Why? step up to the counter. <laughs> no, I'm not Arnleaf. Yes, I know it's called Arnleaf and Sons. Uh, who the hell is Arnleaf? I inherited the store from my husband. His father was Arnleif. My husband, Gunnar, died about five years ago. Forsworn attack. I miss that stubborn oaf. Damn, Forsworn are kind of ruining everything, huh? Store's seen better days, hasn't it? This store would finally be on its feet if I hadn't lost my last shipment to the Forsworn attacks. Oh. A specially made Debella statuette. You aren't for hire, are you? A sellsword? I'll pay you if you can recover that statuette from the Forsworn. Yeah, more work! I'll do it! You say that, but we already have a better Debella statuette. Don't ask where it came from. Thank you. I'll have a sum of gold waiting for you when you return. Retrieve Lisbeth's shipment from Serpent's Bluff Redoubt. To the other redoubt! You've actually done it. You've found the Sibyl of Debella. You have done Markarth a tremendous service. You're welcome. Yeah, word spreads fast. You are better with that bow than you were. Yeah, your skills are constantly improving. Sh shut up. He is complimenting you. It's not a compliment. That was a that was a backhanded compliment. In, in what way was that backhanded? Man, you really sucked with that thing. Now you just only suck a little bit. Does that mean all improvement is an insult? When he says it, yes. I could go fishing down here too. Back when fishing cost money, I didn't do it. But now that fishing is free, I might do a little bit more. Oh. Watch this, watch this, watch this. I'm gonna go bow fishing. I'm seeing it. Oh, okay, I missed that one. Maybe I'm, am I forgetting about refraction? I'm forgetting about refraction. Oh, uh, yeah, that's the issue. Or maybe. What the? What fish is that? <laughs> oh, it's a mud crab. Oh, okay. You disturbed the mud crabs. Alright, whatever. I'm done bow fishing. Alright. Guys, lose a cart. Hey, watch out! There's four sworn in the Come area! Along. No more stops. We need to find our way to solitude. Why are we even going to a wedding at this far-flung end of the Empire, anyway? Mm -hmm. I told you, it's the wedding of Vittoria Vici, an extremely well-connected merchant with the East Empire Company. Cool. The Emperor's cousin, remember? Hopefully these gifts will put us in her good graces, so secure that import everywhere. deal, and lead the way to an audience with the Emperor. Have fun with that. You got loot on you, you say. Stop telling people that we're gonna rob them. <laughs> yep, yeah, uh, Princess Debella is actually a passion dancer. I looked it up. I don't know why she's called that, but apparently that's a thing. Why do you why do you keep calling her Princess Debella? I don't know. I got it wrong the first time, but I just no one ever corrected me. I I corrected you <laughs> several times! <laughs> I'm gonna go over here real quick and Happy. discover this place. 
Oh, okay. So that I have another place on the map that I can go to. Like, why are you touching my hut? We need a fast travel point in the local area. Yep. All right, thanks. It's like when you see someone pull in your driveway and you're just staring <laughs> at them. That's what they're actually doing. That's they're just getting a fast travel point. <laughs> well. Oh, wait. Okay, there's a thing. Ah, That's a hut. Made yeah. out of bones. Made entirely out of bones, and it looks like a, it looks like an evil cult summoning spot. Yeah, this looks like the place. Ooh, a whole village up here. We have been spotted. How? Oh, because we walked into a sewer. <laughs> I think they may know where. <laughs> Damn it! And soon to be forgotten. Is it just the two of them? That's all I can see. No, it wasn't. A third one! Hi, how you doing? Thanks for letting me uh, get that. And the fourth one, mind you! Yeah. I'm doing this one! Ooh, you gotta call dibs! Another victory. Hey. Yes, my friend. Put this on. If you need anything else, just <laughs> ask. Shade mail and kilt. Yup. The matriarch is somewhere nearby. You don't have to be crazy to live here. But it helps. <laughs> Money. Yeah. Oh, no! Oh, come on! I'm gonna kill my summon. No fun! <laughs> oh, it's down here. Aha! Uh -huh, okay. You gotta watch out. There's probably traps everywhere. Those four sure, swords. I see one right there. Oh. Okay. See? Oh. <laughs> Yeah, I see, all right. Hey, how, how's it going? Hi, how are you? Oh, come on! <laughs> Blocked by a fucking rock! <laughs> Look at this. That wasn't even close! Ridiculous! I know I heard Whoa, something. Whoa, hello! <laughs> um. God, they're dumb! <laughs> yep, yeah, uh, they're. Yep. Hey, what was that noise? <laughs> Hey, what was that noise? Oh, oh my god, it's a hag raven! Okay. <laughs> Damn, that hag raven got a booty on her, though! <laughs> Holy shit! Was that the last squad, hopefully? Yeesh. <laughs> what she got? Lipstick on? <laughs> I, it, no, she's just got luscious red lips. That, that, that's completely natural. The fingers, the fingers are throwing me off. I'm gonna be honest, the fingers and the feet kind of weird me out a little bit. It's so hard to use a typewriter or put on shoes. But, like, like... Goddamn, lady! <laughs> Whoa! Yep, you gotta watch out for them traps. Why does that trap reset? <laughs> Why? It's on like ropes. How does it reset? It's some kind of winding mechanism. I don't know. Forest sword might not be literate, but they can make traps. They can't figure out personal hygiene, but they fucking mastered pulleys and winch systems. <laughs> Why the hag raven's gotta be hot though? You know why. A spell tome right there. Yeah, I already have it though. Um. Do you need to cast that tome on? No, it's because it's just frostbite. No, oh. it's not anything special. It's just frostbite. Okay. I mean, it not it might not be special, but usually if there's a tome nearby, it might mean you need to use that tome on the door. I'll try it, but I really don't think that's the case. Uh, no, I guess not. Knocked off the antler though. That's kind of that's kind of fun. Yeah. Okay. 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 What, what, what are we doing around here? Maybe it's something on the table. Maybe it's something on the other side of the room. I don't know. Yeah. The, it's got. There's got to be something in here. I just. I don't know where it is. You pull on the torch. Pull on the sconce. I don't know. Yeah, I, I know I'm overthinking this. <laughs> I know I'm overthinking this, and there's just a pull handle somewhere right around here, or, uh, and I'm missing it. Or there's a button on the table. Oh, it's th it's this. Ah, uh, there's a button. On <laughs> there is a button on their pool table. Yup. So you gotta put an item on top of that to hold it down. There. Okay, the bowl is heavy enough. Works for me. That's silly. I saw that on the table, and I thought it was I thought it was environmental storytelling of look, it's one of the traps that they were using to prepare more traps. They were you they were starting to build a trap on that workbench that they had. Yeah, nope. that's <laughs> I I legitimately thought that's what it was. Yeah. 
Sleeping chambers for the matriarch, I guess. Uh, yeah, this is where the this is where the the hag raven was sleeping. Yeah. This is where the magic happened, literally, because she's got an arcane enchanter right there. <laughs> hey, I leveled up. Nice. Hey, the Diabella statue. Nice. And then, because this thing is right here, I'm just gonna do this. This is chant. Uh, adept robes of alteration. Do we really have to do it now? Here? Yes, I do have to do this here, right now. <laughs> yeah, in the Hagrid's chambers. It's cleared out! Uh... You do what you have to do. I will keep an eye out for trouble. One of us has to stay alert. Fortify. Ooh! I'm gonna look so cool! <laughs> oh. I hate how this cloak looks. Why didn't I put the cloak on before I enchanted it? Uh, that was how, stupid! How you, you look like a beautiful butterfly! Oh, I hate it! Uh, also, I don't want to wear the Archmage robes because this just looks silly. Uh, look at me! Yeah. I look ridiculous! <laughs> yeah, you're looking much cooler now. I think I look really cool. Maybe I look silly with the mask on, <laughs> I will admit. But magic over generates 100% faster? Are you kidding me? Yeah, you're not taking that off ever. And now we can leave. Alright. And I have a new quest. Well, once we turn this in, I have a new quest in life. Uh, which is? Uh, to find a hag raven that won't immediately try to kill me the moment she sees me. Might be a big ask. I, yeah, I know, but horny drives men to do great deeds. <laughs> or very stupid deeds. I'm not sure which one it is. We found a statue and a second statue. We'll, we'll give that one to you for free. It's a freebie. Hey. No, I'm not Arn Leaf. I found this statue in a Forsworn camp. Oh, there it is. This little gold delight is going to keep us afloat for a while. Thank you. Here's something for your hard work. You know, you could have used that gold to keep your store afloat for a long time. I'm sure she has more than that. What else you got for sale? I have a new statue for sale for 200 gold. Wow, you're bad at business. Uh, yeah, she still has no money. All right. Come back whenever you need something. I will do. <laughs> a fine day to you, friend. May you die with a sword in your hands. She's <laughs> holding a dagger. <laughs> Which is sword size for a raccoon. Yeah. That's like in Lord of the Rings, the uh, all the swords the hobbits use are just daggers for normal humans. Because <laughs> <laughs> they're small! I, yep, okay. Cell swords won't be a problem anymore. Because they're dead! That won't be the last we hear from the Silverbloods. But at least we can get back to work. Stop looking at me like that. All right. All right. What's you will not be walking no, away. Don't us. Don't have followed us. You know when I said that the cell swords wouldn't be a problem anymore? Um, 